in the beautiful garden of Sansui. All the flowers were in full bloom. There were flowers of all colors in the garden. Pretty pink, gorgeous green, beautiful blue, wonderful white and many more. However, the trees of the garden were appreciating the beauty of the red rose. Look how lovely the rose looks among all the other flowers. I wish I was also as beautiful, said the apple tree. The wise old banyan tree replied, Dear apple tree, don't say so. All trees and flowers have been made with a purpose. All of us are beautiful in one way or the other. The red rose heard their conversation and retorted, Of course, I am the most beautiful flower in this garden. How can you say that everyone else is also beautiful? Look at that ugly cactus plant standing in the corner. A modest daisy raised its head and said to the rose, You should not say so. In this garden, there are many beautiful flowers. You are only one of them. The red rose felt humiliated. It looked at the cactus and said, Look at the plant. It is ugly and full of thorns. The banyan tree said, Don't be so vain, red rose. Who can say what beauty is? You also have thorns. The red rose got angry at the banyan tree and said, I thought you were wise, but it seems you don't know anything. How can you compare my thorns with those of cactus? In this manner, the red rose would make fun of the cactus every day. It also said that it was superior to all other flowers. But the cactus never got upset and would politely respond that God has created each thing with a definite purpose. Time passed and soon it was summer. It was very hot and dry. The flowers and trees started getting tired because they did not get enough water. The birds and little animals were thirsty too. One day, the tired red rose saw a thirsty bird wander in the garden. It was looking for water. It reached the cactus which was still green and looked happy. The bird stuck its beak into the cactus, drank water from the stem, felt refreshed and flew away. The cactus still stood happy just like it was earlier. The red rose was shocked. It asked the banyan tree about what the bird has done. The banyan tree explained that the cactus was only the plant in the entire garden which had water stored in its fleshy stems. He also said the cactus liked to help the birds to get water in such a hot weather. The red rose said, doesn't it cause pain to the cactus when birds make holes in the stem? Yes, it does, but the cactus doesn't like to see any bird thirsty, replied the wise banyan. The red rose felt very ashamed for its unkind words to the cactus in the past. It realized that one cannot judge the quality of anyone by its appearance. So, what one looks like does not matter, as God created everyone with a purpose. Everyone is special.